Okay, folks, what I want to introduce to you is today is using this alcohol in several different applications. One is whenever you take your here, um, when you take your clothes or your bed here and clean it up and wash your clothes or wash your bed clothes before you start trying to clean the dust and all off of it to kill the bed bugs here in a in a semi truck or at home uh, before you start trying to do anything you can use this right here alcohol and what you do is you get your uh, a spray bottle type and then just screw this on I bought at a dollar store uh, a little bottle and it had this on there and luckily it screwed right on this alcohol bottle here so what I'm gonna do is just spray this and you have it so it's like, you know, the mist. And so what I do is I just start over here and I just go all the way across the bed. Like it's right here. Down beside of it here. And then what I do, that's why my stuff is being in there wash right now. I'm washing them here at the Flying J. What you do is you can pick this up and just spray down this side right here. If there's any bed bugs in there. And um, that's the best way to do that. A lot of times when you do this, right over here, right over here on the light, uh, right here, most time that knob comes off, you have to pick it back up. Right over there, that knob, slide this back over. Put that knob back on. Happens every time I do this. I don't edit my video. There we go. Put that back up. And that's how you do that. And that's, you know, the application with 70% alcohol. You know, at least it's 70%. Um, some of the other ones uh, got less. But, you know, you want to just spray it over. If you want to go over it again, it'll dry. Go down through here. And uh, it'll kill, you know, the bed bugs that's in the dust. And that's what happens is the bed bugs and stuff that gets in in your uh, in your bed. Uh, so um, that works every time. Cause one time I had a problem with um, my legs when I lay down, my feet would itch and my legs would itch, and I couldn't figure out why. I went online and looked it up and it said use alcohol, you know, and it kill bed bugs. I said, well, maybe that's what it is. So when I wash, you know, I wash my bed clothes, but sometimes over time, the skin from your body gets on the bed and then it creates an issue. So use this right here, 70% rubbing alcohol and whatever brand you want to use. This is 70% rubbing alcohol, first aid antiseptic rubbing alcohol. And so you can see right there where it says alcohol on it. So that's the first application. Let's go show you what the second application is. Now right here is gonna be the second application. What this is, is where you can take the rubbing alcohol in the winter time when your brakes freeze up or if you know you're going in a really cold area, what you do is you take this one here off. And when you take this off, you take this off here, inside that hole there you pour alcohol down in there. Or spray some like this.
over here to this and you pull these lines right here. And when you do that, you release all the air out of there. Then you come over here. And when you release all that air, you come over here and you crank it up. And when you crank it up, then what happens is just uh, plugging up my phone here. It's about to die on me. Then when you plug up the phone, when you plug, when you uh, crank it up, and you release all the air down there, what happens is, is it will, it will uh, build back up the pressure. And when it does build up the pressure, and then you take and push these right here. Let me get stuff out of the way right there. You push these in. It sends that alcohol back down to the brakes. But the best way to do it is, is drain the lines, drain the lines completely, pull those, pull those uh, lines there, drain them to two tanks. And then, see there's two tanks down there. That's your air tanks. And you drain these lines, then pour your alcohol in there because alcohol evaporates. So you want to do this first, then pour your alcohol in. And then when you pour your alcohol in, then you come back in here, close this door. Sorry, I got my stuff up here while I wash my clothes. Then you crank it up. And once you crank it up, then you push these in and well you let the air build back up you know it's, the buzzer are going to go off up here on the dash the buzzer are going to go off and then you know it'll build back up and then you push these once you push these right here push the two in it'll send air all the way back down to the brakes uh back into the brake back there in the trailer and it will fall it will uh, remove the ice that's built up in there and so that is the second uh, point of alcohol rubbing the alcohol because this stuff here is some good well I ain't saying this particular brand but I'm just saying when it's got 70% alcohol it doesn't matter what brand it is uh, you know swan or whatever brand um whatever kind you can get get this right here is the best thing to use is uh is a uh, alcohol rubbing alcohol and um uh, far as my um use of alcohol during very cold icy weather putting on your windshield, uh, putting on your headlights, um, it just really does not work, okay? Um, I've tried, they say put rubbing alcohol on your windshield and it'll keep it from freezing up, but in, real, in all reality, that doesn't work too well. I haven't found it to work. I, I sprayed my whole windshield down, left it one night after spraying it, it got really cold, snow and ice, and my windshield was full of it. And it just froze right to the window. <laughs> it did not help out. Alcohol did not help that out at one bit. But when it comes to when it comes to uh, headlights, um, I've sprayed headlights, and it's plastic. You know, the, the lens is plastic, so I sprayed the headlights. I could not get the ice off. I just had to scrape it off with a scraper. Uh, it just chips right off. And, you know, you, uh, you just don't want to put too many, too much chemicals on on headlight because it will dinge them and it will, you know, make them hard to see out of really quick. If you go to putting oils and all kinds of stuff on, on the glass because it's going to really mess up your, your glass. But... Um, or, or the you know the plastic that the headlights are made out of 
so that's really the points that I have on rubbing alcohol you know just you know for human use you can look online for human use uh, it's not for drinking you, you know you don't drink alcohol or anything for any kind of uh, internal this right here is for rubbing and massaging you know it's good for muscles if you have muscle problems you can rub alcohol on your muscles if you have a stomach ache you can rub it on your stomach you know externally rub it on your stomach if you got a stomach ache um, you know it's an antiseptic um, it's it's good for that kind of stuff but uh, keep away from heat spark electrical fire and flame so you want to make sure wherever you put this in the truck that you don't put it where the heat is so I put mine up under the bunk um, outside there at the door I got like four bottles of this bought at the dollar store so and that's why it's a little scuffed up there but anyway and I bought the bottle that has got I bought a, a spray bottle and luckily it just screwed right on top of this bottle here which is a good thing and uh, and I use this bottle here for spraying the bed back there and you know keeping down the bed bugs and all that kill them off and so uh, and it's also you can spray on your hands to kill germs or whatever just like uh, you know like this right here using hand sanitizer it's got alcohol in it kills germs this year's got alcohol in it as well, but this one's nasty bottle because I got it sitting down here. And I got more, about five, six more bottles sitting over yonder. But anyway, um, this is the topic for the day is uh, rubbing alcohol. And so I hope you enjoyed this video and give it a thumbs up. Give it a thumbs up if you like this video. And subscribe for the for the algorithms youtube algorithms and it helps out my channel and thanks so much and y'all have a wonderful blessed safe day